Hello Terraria Enthusiasts, my name is James and today we are going to be trying to defeat the expert Moon Lord now. This is no April Fool's joke, if it is an April Fool's joke, that's when I lose, right? We'll say it's a joke. But now today I'm going to be carrying on with the expert mode playthrough. I'm going to try and defeat the Moon Lord in 1080p, which essentially for those who really don't like play PC games or anything, it just means that the screen is a little bit bigger and I can see more. But the problem is, for some reason, I have no idea, I've never understood this. Uh, with my computer at least, uh, whenever I record Terraria in 1080p, it likes to lower the frame rate just a little bit from 30 like FPS recording to like 24. So if it looks a little bit more jaggy than what you're used to here on Jupiter Gaming, I do apologize. It will only be for this one little section, but for me, it's like God knows how many frames a second, blah, blah, blah. So it won't affect me performance wise in the sense of like, I will still do well or I'll try, uh, but you know. I just thought I'd throw that out there, just so you guys don't think that I've just completely dropped the ball in quality today. Alright, so I just need to completely take out this tower. Alright. Uh, and not die while doing it. If I don't die, that'd be so good. Alright. Come on. Let's not die and take it out at the same time. Let's do a good job. Right, okay, so this should mean impending doom now. Right, I do have that. Right, oh, I want to grab that last one, but... Okay. Right, so everything is good. Everything is golden. Right, impending doom approaches. Now, I know it's weird to start an episode and then not talk, but I'm not going to be talking through this because I genuinely do a lot better if I don't talk through boss fights. Uh, but I'm going to be trying a method that I've already used and failed on. Uh, hopefully it works. I think it will. Uh, I've made some small changes to the world, and you'll see that when it happens. So, um, right, when it stops, when it's uh, blah, 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 time to fight it, I'm going to... Um, Pause the game and move my microphone. Let me just get rid of some of this stuff because I don't really need it. Right, okay. Hopefully this all goes well. All my accessories are in the right order. Right, okay, I have lost this before, so hopefully... Let's move the contaminator. Hopefully we don't die again. It'd be so good if that was true. Alright, come on, buddy. Right, I'm going to hit pause the second he comes in. Just so I can think about taking buffs and move the microphone. Because the microphone is in my face. Come on, it's got to be any second now. There we go. Right, okay. So I'm going to stop talking now play some cool music for you guys. Hopefully this Moon Lord music will be picked up anyway. But uh, I'll see you after the fight.
Ah, damn it. Completely messed it up. Do you want to know how I messed it up? I, uh, I basically didn't do it fast enough. So essentially, when the eye was opening up, I didn't focus enough on the eye, right? So what was happening was when I was trying to beat the eye, like completely knock the eye out, um, I had an issue where it was like, oh, I've not damaged the eye enough. I can't defeat the other two eyeballs, the other two hands, because I've not... Like, I've not worked on it enough, so basically what I've got to do now is I've got to um, remake all my potions, remake all the crafting stuff, have another shot at it, but that was definitely the best one we've done so far. And a lot of people were saying, like, hey, Chippy, you're, you're using an awful method, blah, 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 it's never going to work, blah, blah, blah. A lot of people were just like, it's never going to work. You should be doing this, should be doing this, should be doing this. If we had focused on that eye, because what, basically what it was is, I didn't think about, I was too busy thinking, oh, I've got to dodge this laser, I wasn't hitting it right, my accuracy was off. Uh, but if we'd have if we'd have hit it right, we'd have won that completely. Won that because I wasted so much health just waiting for the top eyes, you know, middle eye to open. Uh, so I'm gonna have another crack at it. And uh, yeah, sorry that the frame rate went all jittery as well. I do apologise. Okay, so I'm doing another fight. Um, and best of luck.
Hell yeah! Oh yeah, and you guys said I couldn't deal with this gear. I mean, can... yeah, I believed in you, you believed in me. And it's done! Woo! Expert mode is complete! Ha <laughs> ha! Hell yeah, man, that is a long journey here though. Wow. But I'm really proud of us, we finally did it! Jesus, and once again. Okay, so, thank you to every single person who has watched and has left ideas for bosses. Thank you to everybody who just says good stuff in general. Uh, thank you to everyone. Uh, so it's not actually the end of the series. Usually I would end this series here, but today we're going to be continuing on. Well, this episode's not, but uh, basically what I said I'd do is I thought as a thank you and as a way to just better myself as a Tori player, we'd continue into expert mode. We should uh, craft all the armors and such and just have a bit of a laugh and try stuff out. Try some mega boss extravaganzas and such. Um... I thought that'd just be a lot of fun, just because I've never done that before. Uh, so yeah, so let's see what we got. Let me just quickly switch back to our normal resolution, though. Okay, that's better. Right, let me turn off auto-pause. Right, okay, treasure bag. Boom. So we got the portal gun, some aluminite, the suspicious-looking tentacle, uh, the last prism, and the violent gravity globe. Do you know what? I didn't know you actually got this much stuff in a Moonlord fight. Last prism, pretty awesome. Okay, pretty, pretty awesome. I don't have a mage set for that. Uh, calls upon a suspicious looking eye to provide light. I know what you're thinking. So, it's a light pet. How bloody cool. Right, let's, um, come here, let's spawn it in. Oh, that's awesome. That is so cool. I didn't know, I didn't know this was actually, I knew it was a thing, but I'd not seen it in such a long time. Portal gun. Oh, yeah, right. Oh, yeah, okay. Sadly, nothing to actually help us out with the next fight, though. Uh, right, so let's have a little look. You actually, you smelt these, don't you? Right, there's 23 there, so I'll probably do as the first half of, um, the first half of a bit of, a uh, a bit of armor. Man, the last prism is cool, but, man, there's only, if only we had stuff to, to go with it. Right, so it's going to take us two fights, apparently, to actually, um, to actually get the full set. So let's just work on it now. I don't know which ones are the best wings, so people leave me a comment down below, which are the best wings? Because uh, I don't actually know, I'll be honest. Right, so we're going to start with the solar stuff. Um, so we'll go with one piece, and then is there any more pieces we can craft for that? No, unfortunately not. But uh, that's going to do it for today's episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you for all your support and such. It feels awesome to finally have beaten an export, an export, an expert moon lord. Um, it feels really, really cool. It feels good to have finally done it. I feel like a, a proper Terraria player now. Um, what is that defense? What is it? 34? What's that? 32. Yeah, I feel like a proper Terraria player now. So, thank you all once again. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one anyway. Because we've got to go through and defeat a few more times. But, man, we've done it. We've done it. We've done it. Oh, yeah. And we got the portal gun. 